the focus of the drills. When we did mass casualty drills 20 years ago, it was motor vehicle accidents, it was building collapses, it, it was train accidents, things like that. Whereas now you've still got the mass casualty, you still you still have the multiple victims that are involved, but you've got a lot different mechanisms of injury. You've got the gunshot wounds, you've got the people that have you know been trampled as is, is you have a mass stampede of people trying to get out of the structure and away from the threat. Yeah, it's a lot of people you gotta make sure they're safe and get them out safe and treat them and get them you know, almost you know, don't let it be any worse than it has to be. You know, everybody's, everybody's gonna be elevated, you know, high if it's you know, a real real situation or other things just gonna, aren't gonna be normal. And it's a really a chance for us to create a scenario where we have a active shooter, the police respond, fire responds, EMS. We can take our time, evaluate how we uh, react, how we respond, how our radio system works. So it's a, it's a great exercise to simulate a real life situation. And in today's world, you have to be ready. So we, uh, we are using this as a training exercise for all agencies to work together. And at the end, we'll sort out how th what things went well, what things didn't go so great. So it's good for us.